O God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. Lord Jesus, think on me, and purge away my sins. From earth born passion set me free, and make me pure within. Lord Jesus, think on me, with care and woe oppressed. Let me thy loving servant be, and taste thy promised rest. Lord Jesus, think on me, Amid the battle strife, in all my pain and misery, be thou my health and life. Lord Jesus, think on me, nor let me go astray through darkness and perplexity. Point thou the heavenly way. You cannot serve both God and wealth. Hear this, all you peoples. Give heed, all who dwell in the world. Men both low and high, rich and poor alike. My lips will speak words of wisdom. My heart is full of insight. I will turn my mind to a parable. With a harp I will solve my problem. Why should I fear in evil days? The malice of the foes who surround me. Men who trust in their wealth. And boast of the vastness of their riches. For no man can buy his own ransom, or pay a price to God for his life. The ransom of his soul is beyond him, he cannot buy life without end, nor avoid coming to the grave. He knows that wise men and fools must both perish, and leave their wealth to others. Their graves are their homes forever, their dwelling place from age to age, for their name spread wide through the land. In his riches man lacks wisdom, he is like the beasts that destroy. To the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, give praise for ever. Amen. You cannot serve both God and wealth. Store up treasure for yourselves in heaven, says the Lord. This is the Lord of those who trust in themselves, who have others at their beck and call. Like sheep they are driven to the grave, where death shall be their shepherd, and the just shall become their rulers. With the morning their outwitch o vanishes, and the grave becomes their home. But God will ransom me from death, and take my soul to himself. Then I not fear when a man grows rich, when the glory of his house increases. He takes nothing with him when he dies, 
His glory does not follow him below. Though he flattered himself while he lived, and will praise me for all my success, yet he will go to join his fathers, who will never see the light any more. In his riches man lacks wisdom, he is like the beasts that are destroyed. To the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, give praise for every man. Store up treasure for yourselves in heaven, says the Lord. Worthy is the Lamb that was slain to receive glory and honour. Worthy are you, our Lord and God, to receive glory and honour and power. For you created all things, and by your will they existed and were created. Worthy are you, O Lord, to take the scroll and to open its seals. For you were slain, and by your blood you ransomed men for God, from every tribe and tongue, and people and nation. You have made us a kingdom and priests to our God, and we shall reign on earth. Worthy is the Lamb who was slain to receive power and wealth and wisdom and might and honour and glory and blessing. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Worthy is the Lamb that was slain to receive glory and honour. What does it profit, my brethren, if a man says that he has faith, but has not works? Can his faith save him? So faith by itself, if it has no works, is dead. Show me your faith apart from your works, and I, by my works, will show you my faith. I said, Lord, have mercy on me. I said, Lord, have mercy on me. Heal my soul, for I have sinned against you. I said, Lord, have mercy on me. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. I said, Lord, have mercy on me. You are all brothers. Do not call any man on earth your father, since you have only one father, and he is in heaven. Nor must you be called teachers, because you have only one teacher, the Christ. My soul glorifies the Lord, my spirit rejoices in God my Saviour. He looks on his servant in a lowliness. Henceforth all ages will call me blessed. The Almighty works marvels for me. Holy his name. His mercy is from age to age. On those who fear him. He puts forth his arm in strength and scared as the proud-hearted. He casts the mighty from their thrones, and raises the lowly. He fills the starving wicked things, sends the rich away empty. He protects his really servant, remembering his mercy. The mercy promised to our fathers, to Abraham and his sons forever. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever, world without end. You are all brothers. Do not call any man on earth your father, since you have only one father, and he is in heaven. Nor must you call, be called teachers, because you have only one teacher, the Christ.
When the Lord Jesus was lifted up on the cross, he drew all things to himself. Let us glorify him in our prayer. Lord, draw men to yourself. Lord, may your cross light up the darkness of the world. May it lead every man to you, the way, the truth, and the life. Lord, draw all men to yourself. Give the true and living water to all who thirst for you. Let it well up to eternal life. Lord, draw all men to yourself. Shed the light of your knowledge on scientists and artists. Let their work make men more open to the coming of your kingdom. Lord, draw all men to yourself. Look on those who no longer walk with you because of scandal or sin. May they return to you and remain in your love. Lord, draw all men to yourself. Grant our dead a place in heaven. Let them share the happiness of Mary and the saints. Lord, draw all men to yourself. At the Saviour's command, and for my divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Watch over your church, Lord, with unfailing compassion and sins left to ourselves we are prone to evil. By your grace turn us away from all that is harmful and direct us into the way of salvation. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.